hey YouTube. It's been a while I don't upload videos in here. Nothing really bad happened. It's just I lost motivation of creating for chat content. Because a few things happened in the community. I don't think it's something personal with the community. It's just a lack of communication probably. But first. I want to tell you how I started this channel on the purpose of it. I knew about Vrchat about 4 years ago. I was watching YouTube randomly. I watch a video about Vrchat on YouTube. I sold that video game where was really good. At that time my social problems were huge. So I saw the VR chat were a good game for me. Because I could meet new people easily. So I started playing desktop Vrchat. At the same time I searched Vrchat content on YouTube on Twitch. I found a lot of streamers. I was really active on all the chats. Then I started collecting clips of the streamers I love. And I edit some videos because I thought holding all the clips together was funny. Some days after. I started uploading those videos, and the people really love them. I continue watching the streamers and editing the videos daily. At some points the channel started to be so popular. It was a growing really fast, and more and more people started to go live on Twitch. My channel somehow become a community channel. Everyone we're sending clips. A lot of people got so many followers thanks to this. I was pretty happy. Community we're growing really fast. This happened because the effort of all the streamers in the community. And also because I was promoting everyone and having all the fun doing all the videos. And here comes the problem. The community used to have fun playing for chat and streaming it. It used to be a big family. But when the money entered the game, Everything gets destroyed. A lot of people joined the community because they only wanted money. The community slowly became more and more selfish. Ego everywhere. Those who started to stream really late in the community. They didn't know who I am. They thought I was just stealing all the content without permission. Just begging for money. That is not true. My close friends know how am I. They know all the effort I put into this. They know I got monetization denied for almost two years. And when I got it I only had it for a few months. Some people started to say really bad things about me. But nobody ever tried to talk with me. Everyone started to think I was a parasite. Some people thinks I was there because I only wanted the content. But nobody ever tried to talk with me personally. Nobody ever told me. Hey funny. I think this about your content. Is this true? I don't want to be in your videos anymore. And of course I will tell them an okay no problem. I asked everyone before including their videos. Some people said I started to include the videos, super big streamers, because I only wanted more fame. Yes I featured them. Cause if you want to get views on YouTube do you have to follow the trend. I always include small streamers in the compilations. Because I always wanted to help those who are smaller. But some people took me a part of the community. Those words. Lately I've been feeling really down. When I knew they were saying about me. I feel betrayed. But I am not angry. I know I helped a lot of people and I am really proud about it. But I don't feel welcome anymore, so that's why I stopped doing the compilations. I know some people wants me to continue. I know a part of the community loves me. But I don't want to continue doing this. That's why I've stopped doing them. Vrchat change me. I met a lot of people. People who I call them close friends nowadays. My social problems are going better than better. I found out that I love streaming on creating content. I know it's been a while I don't upload videos here. It was because I was feeling so bad with myself. I need some time. But now. I am back. I'm going to focus on myself. Starting December I'm going to start a few projects. I just want to say. Thank you. Thank you to everyone who supported me during this time. Thanks to all the friends who are always there, if I need them. And thank you to the Vrchat for changing me and helping me with all my problems. I love you all. Take care okay? Goodbye. Bye bye. I knew about Vrchat Adam 4 years ago. I knew about Vrchat about 40 years ago. So I started playing next up your chat. So I started playing next stop Vrchat. Desktop. And I edited some videos because I thought having all the kids together.
having all the kids go to ride? What the fuck? Can you say what I want to say? Please. Okay. My child somehow become a community channel. Child. Do I have a child? If I have one I can't find them. Oh my god I lost my child. I'm a bad mom. F. Where everyone could submit the eclipse. God damn it. And I was really happy, because the beer tap community was growing really fast. And it was really happy because the BR chat media was growing really fast. Anniversary happy because the VRChat community was growing really fast. I wasn't really happy because the VRChat community was growing really fast. It's going to take me ages. Why would you want to talk seriously? It fails aloud. I want to talk seriously. Come on TDS. Come on 2DS.